It is awesome to finally have it back, you know, like it's been good. Canada Day long weekend kicked off on Friday with the return of one of the meatiest events in Penticton, Ribfest. Well, we've, it, we've had three years to plan, which was lovely because we're in a completely different venue. So we're kind of excited about being at Skaha Park. A lot more shade at Skaha Park, which is lovely. We have a great kid zone, Inspire Circus is there, we've got professional face painters, we've got other games going on, we have a beverage garden, uh, and we also have a family friendly beverage garden, so if you have children under 19, you can still come down and have a beverage uh, and enjoy that, and then the stage is up near the water and there's entertainment going on all three days. It costs you nothing to come in, you pay for what you consume. Funds raised from Ribfest go towards all of the local rotaries, community and charitable initiatives. This is a great tourism draw, but even more than that, it helps the Rotary Club run, uh, raise funds for the community. Uh, most of the money that Rotary brings in stays in the community. Our latest project was we put $150,000 into rebuilding the splash pad at Skaha. Prior to that, we put one hundred and fifty dollars into the foundry, so, so your money's going to good places. Ribfest runs until Sunday, July 3rd at Skaha Lake Park. For Castnet News and Penticton, I'm Casey Richardson.